Hey. Ah uh ah. -uh. Don't scream or struggle. You know the drill, Switch Hicks. Into the alley. Now. Back against the wall. Dot said. All right, sweetheart. Hand over all your money and jewelry. Good girl. The necklace. And the ring. Keep him coming. I said all of it. Hand it over. Don't play with me. That dress you're wearing says you're made of money. <laughs> Fine. Maybe I'll just take the dress then. And... Uh, something else more valuable. <laughs> you are very beautiful. Oh, feisty, are we? This is going to be so much fun. <laughs> Get your filthy hands off her. Now. Huh? Who the hell are you? Get lost. Last chance. Let. Her. Go. You wanna try me, asshole? Come on! Huh. <laughs> Too easy, <laughs> bastard. Are you all right, Dollface? Good. But God, you're shaking. Ah, uh, don't worry. I didn't kill him. He'll just wake up with a nasty headache and a newfound fear of God in him. Are you hurt anywhere? That's good. I would hate to see such a pretty thing like yourself get roughed up by a thug like that. Me? <laughs> nah, just a small bruise. I've had much worse. So, what's a lovely thing like you doing out alone at this hour? Heading home. On foot in such a lovely outfit. Do you not have a car or... Someone's coming. Stay behind me, dollface. Ugh. What the hell are you doing here, Johnny? Huh. <sighs> my buddy. My pal. My ride or die. How many times have I told you to go home tonight? Okay, well this is the fourth and final time. Please go home. I don't care what the Don says. I don't need protection. I can handle myself pretty well. Thank you very much. Look, just please go home. Tell the Don I ordered you to. I'll handle his wrath. Huh. <sighs> I am his son. He won't go too hard on me. Now go. Your wife is missing you. My apologies for that doll face. Johnny's a nice guy. Really. I hope he didn't scare you. True? You mean... The whole son of a mafia boss thing. 
<laughs> Cat's out of the bag, so no use in denying. Yes, I am. The name's Darion. Named after my father. I am the eldest son of the boss of the audio family. The most powerful syndicate in the city. Whoa, whoa. Easy. Hold on to my arm. Are you all right? A little louder, dear. I couldn't hear you. Oh my, <laughs> a little starstruck, are we? After being saved by a powerful mafia man? <laughs> That's adorable. But seriously, I couldn't just stand by and let him hurt you. Speaking of which, back to my original question. What are you doing out here at this late hour? Heading home after a bad date? And he just left you without any means of getting back home? Pfft. And Kelth bastard. I'm so sorry you had to deal with that. And to think what would have happened if I hadn't. Uh, duh. Dollface, if it's alright with you, I would like to drive you back home. I want to make sure that you get back safely in one piece. It's no problem at all. Really. It would be my pleasure. Besides, that blush on your face when I offered, it made it so worth it. <laughs> Allow me to show you how a real gentleman, a real gentleman of power, Escorts a beautiful lady home. My car is just right down the street. Just tell me where to go, and I'll get you there in a jiffy. Come on, let's get you out of this nasty alley. This is it. My valiant steed. <laughs> Very nice, right? Please, allow me, dollface. Huh? A driver? Nah. Well, it's nice on nights when I go out drinking. I prefer to drive myself. I can come and go as I please without having to wait on someone. <laughs> well, aren't you the sweetest? I am glad to know that I look like a dashing, powerful mafia guy without the Hollywood Marlon Brando personality. While some of the luxuries of being the Don's son are nice, they're not really my cup of tea. Especially since I'm suffocated by the stupid expectations and rules. With handlers or bodyguards, or whatever the hell my father calls the men he constantly sends to follow me, it gets a bit overwhelming. I just want to live my life on my own terms. That's all. Oh yes, someday I will inherit the family business, and I take pride in that. But that doesn't mean that I have to be cooped up like some spoiled blue blood. I know how to run operations. Hell, I do some of them already. But my father and I, we don't quite see eye to eye, you know. Uh, it's fine. Generational differences. But once that old man croaks, I'll be modernizing the audio family and show the other families what true power is. But enough about me. Tell me about you, dollface. 
I don't think I've even caught your name yet. Hmm. Very pretty. It suits your sweet face perfectly. <laughs> so, what do you do for a living? Uh huh. Oh, really? That's fascinating. For how long have you been doing that? Well, you're doing God's work out there, my dear. Whether you believe it or not. I really mean it, Dollface. That's really amazing. Me amazing? <laughs> nah. I'm just your friendly neighborhood guy. Who just happens to be the heir of a powerful underground empire. You want to thank me? Oh, Dollface. There's no need to. Truly, I, uh... Hmm, well, I won't say no to a kiss on the cheek. Or your sweet hand rubbing my chin. Oh, yes. I like it a lot. You want to give tribute to the Don's hair? Huh. You're doing a fine job already. But humor me, dollface. What do you have in mind? <laughs> <laughs>